Hello everybody, welcome back for another speed art this week. We are doing Stinkfly as the second to last of the original Ben 10 aliens that I have been um, redesigning in a way that they might appear if they existed in the real world. I was going to do this later, but I found a design really quickly that I really liked and I went with it. So this piece took me about five hours, I want to say, and I've been using that new... Um, technique where I don't use any line art and I, I feel like that's really done wonders for this piece. I'm definitely going to keep doing that in the future now that I've not mastered it but um, I want to say fully learned the technique um, for an upcoming series of videos that I haven't um, announced yet but I'm actually going to announce next week so keep an eye out for that. Um, I found this picture. I hope that I remember to put this up in editing but it's of like a dragonfly dragon thing. Um, and that gave me a cool idea, like a concrete idea of where to send this piece. Um, and so with that in mind, and the mind of its environment of probably like a, a dense jungle, I designed Stinkfly um, as I would have imagined it if, if he come across in real life, so yeah. Worked a lot on the shading and the highlights uh, this week, and I actually changed a little bit of the physical format of the piece. It's a little unlike um, the other pieces look, but I feel it really worked out. You're, you're going to see it towards the end, but I um, sort of grounded Stinkfly in the image with a bit of a reflection, as if there's like a glossy floor beneath it. I've seen that done in some character art, and I think it looks good, and I just wanted to try it out, and I'm actually really happy with it, so I'm probably going to stick with that um, in the future. So yeah, that's really all I have to say. Um, I'm going to try to keep it brief this week and leave you with the rest of the speed art. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys next time. I hope you enjoy. Bye-bye.